In the 4.6 billion years since the Earth has existed, primates only appeared within the last 56 million years, during the Cenozoic era. Because very few of the individuals that lived in the past leave behind fossil remains, and even fewer of those fossils are actually recovered, paleontologists must be able to identify species from a single bone or bone fragment. The features that characterize modern primates include those that are involved with enhanced vision, such as forward-facing eyes and enclosed eye orbits, decreased reliance on the sense of smell, as indicated by a reduced snout, increased relative brain size, as well as relatively generalized dentition. Primates also have grasping hands and feet, as well as nails instead of claws. Primate ancestors during the Paleocene epoch, from 66 to 55 million years ago, called the Plesiodapiforms, lacked many of the features associated with primates today. Compared to modern prosimians, plesiodapiform eyes faced to the sides and were not encased in bone. They had more prominent snouts and relatively smaller brains. While most of these animals lacked proficient grasping ability and had claws instead of nails, some did have grasping fingers and a flat nail on an opposable big toe. Features characteristic of modern primates were present by the Eocene epoch. These first true primate species belonged to two families, the Omamiids, similar to Targeres and Galagos, and the Adapids, comparable to modern lemurs. These primates had forward-facing eyes encased in bone, reduced snouts, and grasping hands and feet with opposable digits, as well as flat nails instead of claws. They also had relatively larger brains. Primates similar to modern-day monkeys, such as the arboreal quadrupedal Egyptopithecus, flourished during the Oligocene epoch. During the early Miocene era, early hominoids, which include apes and humans, such as the proconsulids, evolved in Africa. They had several derived traits similar to modern apes, such as larger brains, the absence of a tail, and fleshy sitting pads, common among monkeys. Like the earlier Oligocene primates, however, their postcranial remains indicate that they were arboreal quadrupeds, and their dentition suggest that they subsisted on fruit. Many of the middle to late Miocene hominoids from Africa, Asia, and Europe had more derived ape like traits. For example, Oreopithecus had limb morphology associated with suspensory locomotion and dentition adapted for harder foods, such as fibrous vegetation. The Miocene hominoids, however, varied considerably in their adaptations for locomotion and posture. While most of the Miocene species became extinct, Sivapithecus is a likely candidate for the ancestor to present-day orangutans.